My name is Dirk Bore. Um, I'm German by origin. However, I left the country more than 20 years ago and um, developed a career overseas in all sorts of different countries. Um, I worked in industry, uh, specifically in international logistics, international market research as well, and also international project management before I joined academia. Um, during my academic career, I gained a whole lot of experience in different countries. I started basically in South America um, and then I spent also several years in Australia and New Zealand um, and my last position was in fact Professor of International Business. Now recently I came to Morocco. I'm here in the position of a full Professor of Strategic Management. And um, I would also like to highlight that I have um, occupied several leadership positions um, in academia as well. So, for example, in the past, uh, I have been in charge of a PhD program uh, in business administration, but also I've been in charge of a master of international business at another university in South, um, South Australia, more precisely. Um, I also used to be um, in charge of undergrad programs um, at a top school in Brazil, in uh, the position of um, uh, vice uh, dean um, in, uh, for undergraduate studies. Um, and now, uh, recently here at uh, Africa Business School, um, I'm working in the field of strategic management, as mentioned, um, I do my teaching in strategic management combined with related areas such as uh, corporate social responsibility, also a little bit of uh, international corporate governance. Um, and uh, this is also what I do my research on. So for example, in the past I've developed research programs in the field of uh, export strategies. So think of a firm that um, seeks to conquer international markets um, with their export products. So I've uh, looked at the question of uh, the, the determinants and also the outcomes of uh, different kinds of export strategies. And I've also combined this with corporate social responsibility. So for example, I've looked at um, uh, the effect of uh, uh, socially and environmentally uh, responsible projects and uh, products and processes um, on the performance of an export firm. Um, and this is of course very much related uh, to our work here in the context of the Master of International Management. In my teaching I look at what's important for our graduates to be successful in their future career, in other words in the job market. So a key emphasis is actually on application application of knowledge that we deliver in our classes to managerial practice, of course, in international business and in international management. So how do we do this? Uh, we use uh, a lot of case-based uh, activities in the classroom. I've myself written several teaching cases. Um, several of them have been published in renowned international textbooks in the meantime. And uh, in addition to that, we try to connect this with team-based activities for our students such that they also develop team leadership and team management skills that are, of course, again, highly demanded by uh, industry, highly demanded by recruitment managers. So we want to really prepare our students for the challenges they face in the job market. And in addition to that, we look at uh, problem-based uh, learning and teaching methods. So we implement this in a whole lot of our courses in the Master of International Management. And we strengthen also the connection uh, to data and to evidence. So evidence-based management is also an underlying element of our teaching activities. Because very often it isn't any more sufficient for um, a manager when he or she presents in front of the board or in front of their colleagues um, just to say, yeah, we should probably do this or this or that. What we need our, um, our graduates to be capable of is to provide evidence uh, to support their arguments and their decisions. And we want to strengthen this skill within the classroom at ABS.